from WMAR 2 News, Maryland's most accurate forecast. I like that idea. Taking a test before you fly, I think it alleviates a lot of people's worry as they travel, maybe doing a little bit of summer planning as they travel away. Although you don't really want to get away from Baltimore just quite yet. We had a cold front move through and that dropped our humidity. So tomorrow is going to be picture perfect as we end up seeing temperatures in the 80s with dry conditions. Currently, though, we are looking at around 88 degrees. Normally, we're sitting up to about 82. So above average today, we'll slowly watch those values coming down, though. The rainfall today associated with that cold front has now pushed well off to the east and so are the clouds. The clouds are starting to thin out and we'll end up seeing plenty of sunshine tomorrow as a result. Currently as you get ready for bed, Chestertown, you're at 73 degrees. Good evening in Columbia at 75. That's a popular number. It's your number as well into Annapolis. These temperatures have dropped about three degrees in Annapolis, four in Essex and in Bel Air. So the cold front wasn't really cold. What it really did though was switch our wind direction and allowed for drier air to come down. So that's what it's going to be most noticeable tomorrow. If you do have any lunch plans, tomorrow's looking great to go ahead and make your reservations on outside. The cold front now pushing well off to our east and we have high pressure building on in in between and with that clouds clearing out humidity drops it is still warm though remember the normal is 82 degrees we will be in the mid 80s so these temperatures remain above average and then check out what's happening in the corner of your screen our next cold front is on the way Saturday night. So the timing of this is key here. Right now we're looking at it bringing mostly cloudy skies on Saturday, dropping temperatures five degrees. The rain should hold off and sink until after your dinner plan. So all day Saturday looks great for any sort of bike rides you have. I think the shower is really going to begin to increase once we head through Sunday and early next work week. Temperature wise with the fronts, look what happens here at 6 a.m. We're talking about the upper 60s and then fast forward to one o'clock. We're back on into the lower 80s for us, it's slightly above average. And at five o'clock, Bel Air, you're 82. Annapolis now sitting at 84. The difference here, though, on Saturday, look. By one o'clock, we're not talking about the 80s. The 70s across the board. We stay that way for your dinner time as well. So pleasant, though, for those barbecue plants. And now, plus your hourly forecast, sunshine stamped across the board there. By noon, already on into the 80s, reaching the mid 80s by 4 p.m. Seven day forecast, 85 degrees on your Friday. We drop temperatures on Saturday with more cloud coverage. Also, notice that chance of rainfall. It lingers through the area as well, Sunday, all the way until we get to about Wednesday or even Thursday. Temperatures, though, start to rebound by the end of next work week as we get finally back into the low to mid 80s. That's a look at your seven day forecast, Jamie.